Hello, hello. Dead plants? Possible plant slaughter? Oh my God, let me take some notes. I'm on my way. I'm on the scene. Here we have it. We see this quite often. This is a plant that's been planted in deep, very wet conditions. There's actually water in the bottom of the hole. So it's been sitting in water. And what's a dead giveaway? If you smell it, it stinks like a septic tank. Plant it down deep, actually sitting in the water and mud. What happens is that the organic matter rot and the plant asphyxiates a plant slaughter situation. What we have to do is we'll have to raise him up, up a lot higher so that he's not sitting down in the water and plant him with a good planting mix. So here we are, what I've done is I've, I've topped up the soil in the bottom of the hole with some planting mix. I'm now going to add some soil wetter in the bottom of the hole actually helps with drainage. And then we're gonna plant our plant in here nice and high. We're gonna come up quite a bit higher than what we were. Up. It's better to mound it up a little bit than to have it sitting down in the water because that's really quite deadly. Straighten them up. Now we can put the pebbles back around him. So now we've got him sitting nice and high, pebbles back around him, looking good, up nice and straight. He's not down in the water, he'll be able to breathe and grow and be fine. Another root rot case closed. <laughs> Another tough day on the streets, keeping the gardens of Melbourne free from plant slaughter. Like and follow for more.